Fuck yes, more Mandalorian. I am so fucking excited for Mandalorian Season 2. Wow, I get fucking weird on camera sometimes. Mandalorian Season 2, the trailer just dropped today. Hopefully you are seeing this video tomorrow because I really don't want to get behind on this and I really want to get a video out about my reaction to the trailer. I am so excited for more Mandalorian. All right, take two of this video because the first one turned into a completely different video that I am going to completely scrap and redo because I want to make another video. Anyway, Mandalorian Season 2 was just... <sighs> the trailer was just dropped and... <sighs> if you like Season 1, you're gonna love this! Probably, most likely. Ah, oh, man, this trailer looks so good. So many, the opening shot with like descending, it almost looked like he was attacked, it was like descending into an atmosphere, like closing the back. <sighs> mm. So good. Just so many like scenic things. There's a voiceover in it, it's really cool. It says that he has to find and give the baby Yoda to the Jedi. And he's like, the fuck do I have to give it to the enemy? It's so cool. It's just, um, more Mandalorian goodness, more fun, more epicness. It's, I'm so excited for the show. Now, do I think anything looks bad within the trailer? Kind of. The trailer didn't show us much action, though to be fair, a lot of the trailers for the initial season of Mandalorian didn't either. My fear comes from, I don't know if season 2 is going to be able to capture the magic that is season 1. Let me explain. I'm personally afraid that season 2 is going to be seen as a more inferior version of the first season, as a lot of second seasons and sequel films are. But if it can hold up the magic and it can hold up the epicness from season one, I'm gonna be super excited. I'm stoked either way. Personally, I'm extremely excited. A lot of the shots in this looked really, really fun. The storyline looks hell of a lot of fun. It looks like he's gonna end up on, I can't remember the name of the planet, but uh, the Mon Calamari's planet, the planet that Akbar is from. Yeah, it looks like he's gonna end up on that planet and just, <sighs> I, I cannot wait to see where this show takes its story. I love the dynamic between the Mandalorian and Baby Yoda. It's just so much fun. It's it's a hell of a lot of, it's super entertaining. I love watching it. It's so much fucking fun. Super entertaining. And I just, I'm so excited. I'm so happy that this show continued. I'm so happy you did well. Star Wars is one of my favorite franchises and ah, I'm so happy for another season. Also, one part of the trailer that I absolutely loved is basically they are in a fight ring and the Mandalorian like gets surrounded to get attacked and um, like you see one of his gauntlets light up. Baby Yoda just reaches out, pushes the button and his pod closes up, the screen goes dark and you just hear like a bunch of death sounds. Uh, like people dying and the last shot it comes up he's throwing a knife into what looks like a member of uh, Darth Maul's race the Knight Brothers I think they're called I can't remember exactly uh, but yeah the race that Darth Maul is from it looks like one of them <laughs> it's a lot of fun and I'm just I'm so happy I'm so excited the show did well I'm so excited I'm so happy to continue these adventures of Mandalorian into the next season of the show but, whew. yeah, those are my thoughts on the trailer. I know it's an extremely short video compared to what I normally put out, but, you know, not a ton to talk about with a trailer reaction. I don't want to keep pushing this to 10 minutes because that will inevitably turn into a different video of me talking about why I think the side stories in Star Wars are where the core of Star Wars truly lies. But that is all that I have for now, guys. I hope that y'all have a fantastic fucking day. And as always, Peace out, guys.